and steel. Elixir. Quite a few Phoenix Downs, which is nice. I had that all game. All right, let's go. What's going on here? Oh, there's stairs. Okay, and a fight. Another one of those tank guys. I thought that was just like a little mini boss. I don't think it gave me anything, did it? You gave me a eight inch cannon. That's what you gave me. Oh my god! Two in a row. <laughs> Bye. It's just chasing us. That's what's happening. Come on, go around. Go around. There you go. This way, clown. Right behind you, fat cat. What's that noise? Is that supposed to be the wind? No problem, man. Yeah, I'll still be here. Oh, look at these guys. That guy's stuck in front of me. Look at that. It's weird. <laughs> he didn't go back. There it goes. I want to steal whatever they have. It's not gonna work. <laughs> Red <laughs> just decided to kill him. All right, I don't know what they had because I couldn't steal it. Oh, we're almost, we're so close to 200,000 gil. Hey, buddy. Can you stop beating on that for a second? Oh, Joe, stop right there. Oh, the failure. At least remember my name. It's Cloud. Every time I see you, it pains me that I had so little scientific sense. I saw you as a failed project, but you're the only one that succeeded as a Sephiroth clone. <laughs> I'm beginning to hate myself. None of that matters. Just stop this nonsense. Nonsense? Oh, this? <laughs> Sephiroth seems to be counting on the energy. So I'm going to lend him a hand. Why? Why do you do, why do, you do that? <laughs> Quit asking me why, you moron. Hmm. Actually, you might make a good scientist. Energy level is at 83%. It's taking too long. My son needs power and help. That's the only reason. Your son? <laughs> but he doesn't know it. <laughs> What will Sephiroth think when he finds out I'm his father? He always looks down on me. <laughs> You're crazy now. His brain is shattered. Sephiroth is your son? <laughs> I offered the woman with my child to Professor Gastinova project. 
Really? Lucretia? Alright. When Zephyroth was still in the room, we took Genova cells. <laughs> you. I can't believe you're the one who did this. Illusionary crimes against Sephiroth. Or was that illusory? I didn't pay attention. <laughs> you're not wrong. It's my desire as a scientist. <laughs> I was wrong. The one that should have slept was... Oh, Genova fight! You, Hojo. I was defeated by my drive to become a scientist. I lost that time, too. I've injected Genova cells into my own body. <laughs> Here are... <laughs> the results! I love the Genova boss music. Ew, you've gone green. <laughs> Alright, let's uh throw up some stuff. Cloud, go ahead and start with the clean hazard, bro. Oh god. I thought it was 9,000 damage. Oh, he summoned friends. I did not expect that. Only 2,000? That's rough. Nope. No, I'm trying to- I'm trying to regen. Hit everyone. It's not. <laughs> Red's gonna kill the ads by counters. It'd be awesome. Yeah, let's pull and bomb it. He's cool. Speed it up. <laughs> that tickle a little bit? Oh my gosh, this thing survived? Gross. Ah, now I see how to make the Genova juices something. Oh, okay. Never mind. Get wrecked, ugly. Oh, never mind. Okay. Ew. Gross. Uh, get Hades. Alright, speed it up. Ew, that thing is nasty. Do your woo juice on him. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Oh, I can attack his special arms. Uh, yeah, man. Go, go ham, Red. We like, we like watching you do that. It's cool with me. No. Oh, please do not send him crazy when he's rage mode. That would suck. Woo! Goodbye, arm. Again. No, don't put. Uh, yeah, do it to Cloud. He can't sleep. He's got ribbons, stupid. Eat the green smoke.
Ew. Oh, his face is all jacked up. Ew, 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 ew. What is that? Ew, he's... He's... He was handling himself. That was gross. You gross, Hojo. Oh my god! You're still not dead. Okay. Well, I'm pretty much all out of magic power, so... Was that stop? Oh, he slowed me down. That sucks. Combo. Alright. <laughs> you suck. He's just punching the crap out of red. Ah, and he put him to sleep! I didn't think Berserk could be put to sleep. Oh, he does random status effects. What? That's wild. Dude, this is the weirdest. Not even, not even worth it. I still have regen up, right? Do I not? No, it looks like it disappeared because I should be flashing colors. I didn't think it ran out. Ew, getting tentacled! Seen enough anti to know where that's going. Ow. Oh, my friends are all asleep and oh god, Clouser is dead. Just picking on Cloud, don't kill me. No, damn it, just as soon as I got his ult too. Alright. You gonna have to attack someone else? No, dummy. That was uh, the worst decision you could have made, actually. Because now he awake and he gonna mess you up. Is he just gonna go down the line trying to kill all my people? Sure seems that way. Yeah, get wrecked, stupid. Jeez, that was three different forms. Yeah, Red just gained even more life. Ooh, and a power source. Go to sleep, stupid. Bojo. Rest in peace. Really? After he did all that messed up stuff? Vincent, you are a very forgiving person, apparently. The father. Don't be another fight. We're not prepared for that. Okay, apparently we're back on the high wind. Shinra's finished. Meteor's gonna fall in about seven more days. Or seven more days. That's what grandfather said. Red. You want to see everyone in Cosmo Canyon again? Yes. You want to see Marlene, right? Don't ask me that. We'll beat Sephiroth. Then, if we don't release the power of Holy in seven days, there won't be a planet left to protect. If we can't beat Sephiroth, it's as good as death for us. We'll just go a few days sooner, then the rest will die from Meteor. I don't think you're gonna lose before you even fight! No. What I meant was... What are we all fighting for? I want us all to understand that. Save the planet, for the future of the planet. Sure, that's all fine. But really, is that how it is? For me, this is a personal feud. I want to beat Sephiroth and settle my past. Saving the planet just happens to be part of that. I've been thinking. I think we all are fighting for ourselves. For ourselves, and for that someone. Something. Whatever it is, that's important to us. That's what we're fighting for. That's why we keep up this battle for the planet. You're right. 
It sounds cool saying that it's to save the planet. But I was the one who blew up the Mako reactor. Oh man, hiccups and burps and trying to speak in a weird voice at the same time. Not a good com er, combination. Looking back on it now, I can see things. See that that wasn't the right way to do things. I made a lot of friends and innocent bystanders suffer. At first, it was revenge against Shinra for attacking my town. But now, yeah, I'm fighting for Marlene. For Marlene? For Marlene's future? Yeah, I guess I want to save the planet for Marlene's sake. Go and see her. Make sure you're right and come back. All of you, get off the ship and find out your reasons for yourselves. I want you to make sure then I want you to come back. Maybe I ain't none of Maybe ain't none of us come back. Meteor's gonna kill us all anyway. Let's just forget any useless struggling. I know why I'm fighting. I'm fighting to save the planet, and that's that. But besides that, there's something personal too. A very personal memory that I have. What about you all? I want all of you to find that something within yourselves. If you don't find it, then that's okay too. You can't fight without a reason, right? So I want you to hold it against you. So I won't hold it against you if you don't come back. <laughs> oh, Tifa stayed. What are you gonna do, Tifa? Did you forget? I'm all alone. I don't have anywhere to go. Everyone's gone. Yeah, we don't have anywhere any or anyone to go home to. You're right. But I'm sure someday I'll come back, don't you think? Hmm. I wonder. Everyone has something irreplaceable they're holding on to. But this time, our opponent. Hmm, that's alright. If no one comes back, as long as we're together, with you by my side, I'll never give up no matter how bad it gets. Tifa. No matter how close we are now, we were far apart before. But when we were in the live stream, surrounded by all those screams of anguish, I thought I heard your voice. You probably don't remember this, but deep in my heart, I heard you calling my name. Or at least, I thought you did. I see. I think I've heard it too. Then, it was Tifa's voice. Cloud, do you think the stars can hear us? Do you think they see how hard we're fighting for them? I don't know, but whether they can or not, we still have to do what we can and believe in ourselves. I'll find the answer someday, as long as I keep trying. Yes, that's right. We've got a big battle tomorrow. We'd better get some sleep. Bow, chicka, wow, wow. Um, I guess you're right. It's almost dawn. Huh? huh? You just slept there? Ah, oh, that looks uncomfortable. Morning, Tifa. It's almost dawn. Good morning, Cloud. Just a little longer. A little bit longer. Uh. This day will never come again, so let me have this moment. Aw, she's cute. 